Karin Scassell here on behalf of Makers Mercantile with the top five things to look for in today's newsletter. We have a lot of new items in today's newsletter. We have a new yarn, we have new ribbons, we have new fabrics, we have a new event next Tuesday, lots of new things. So just stay with me for the next 10 minutes and I'll get through it all. Item number one, we brought in a new yarn from June Cashmere. So if you haven't heard of June Cashmere, they are a company that they're actually based out of the East Coast, but they get all their yarn sourced from Kyrgyzstan. And in Kyrgyzstan, they have an elite group of um, nomads that are raising herds of goats to specifically make their cashmere, which is a truly a really, really fine cashmere. Now, I'm not gonna go into the whole story um, of how this all happens, because next Tuesday at 5 p.m., we are going to have Sai, and I'm not even going to pronounce his last name, um, on a Zoom call with us directly from, from Kyrgyzstan. And Amy, she's gonna be calling us, I think she's on the East Coast. Um, she is the director, he is the founder, of June um, uh, Cashmere, and they are going to be telling their story through photos and a conversation. So we are very, very excited for that. That is next Tuesday, the 10th. It's at 5 p.m. You do have to register, but it is a free event. And before I tell you more about this yarn, let me just tell you, you do want to register. You know why? Because thanks to their company, we are going to be giving away one free hank this hank right here is going to be going to one lucky person who tunes in with us on um on our zoom call on tuesday night you're also going to get this fabulous pattern which is for the embrace cow and i guess that's a really good lead-in into the embrace cow so this here is the um it's called the embrace cow it is a design by rami hill and i'm going to bring it in a little bit closer so you can see some of the detail work um, this cowl in particular only takes one of the 50 gram hanks of uh, the cashmere and we brought it in in a fingering weight only at this point. We'll see how it sells in the fingering weight and if we have another um, or a lot of people requesting the other weights, we will bring that in as well. But this fingering weight is just luscious. It is so soft to the touch when it's knitted. Um, I mean, it is, it's it's like butter. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, I can show you the cowl a little bit better again here. Um, but what we are going to do, so since we just got this in, we are going to give you, we're going to gift you this pattern for free if you purchase one hank. And we will do that between now and August 12th. So August 10th is going to be our discussion with Amy and Cy, and then you have till the 12th to purchase your hank, and we will gift you that pattern for free. And that is a pattern from uh, Rami Hill, if I didn't mention that before. Anyways, this cashmere, well, I can't say enough good things Things about it. It is so soft. It is um, intelligently sourced and you'll understand why I say that on Tuesday. Um, and look at this little photo of the, the little kid with the goat. I mean, I just think that is adorable. And that is a photo directly from um, Kyrgyzstan. Anyways, and just so you know, I thought this was a really interesting tidbit. June is not a person. It's not a woman who uh, founded the company. June is actually the word for animal fiber in, um, oh, how do you say it? You don't say Kyrgyzstan, you say in uh, Kyrgyz, I think it is. Anyways, that is their word for animal fiber. And um, so I learned that and I think that was really interesting. So I'm going to move right along, um, but I would highly encourage you, this event on Tuesday is free, it's at 5 p.m. You have a chance to win a hank with the pattern so you can make your own little um, uh, cashmere cowl, Keep it for yourself, gift it to someone, I would keep it for myself. Anyways, um, we're really looking forward to that. So that is our new yarn. Now we received some new ribbons in too. We received them from Renaissance Ribbons and we do have quite the selection of Renaissance Ribbons. And if you're not familiar with Renaissance Ribbons, um, here, let me show you this one. Um, this one in particular, I believe is called Strawberry Sprout on pink. And um, I do think it, um, is this one? I think it is from uh, a, a Tula pink um, uh, pattern. And if we look on the inside, I just want to show you what makes these ribbons so special. Look at the back side of that ribbon. Do you see that? That back side shows you it is a woven ribbon. These are not printed. This is not, 
you know, um, inexpensive ribbon. This is a really good, solid, beautiful ribbon that is woven. And we have a lot of them in stock. This is one of the new ones. This is another new one we um, received. This is called Fresh Cut. Um, I do believe this is a Sue Spargo one. Um, then we received this one, which is called Tiny Flowers which truly is tiny flowers, and it's only 3 8 inches wide. Um, this one is beautiful. Look at these peacock feathers. I mean, we think this is absolutely stunning. Um, and all of these would look really great on the inside of the border um, of a sweater that you are knitting, the, the button placket. Um, you can use ribbons to do so many different things. Uh, you can adorn pillowcases, you can adorn towels, um, you can put them on the inside of your garments, on the outside of your garments, you can put them on sleeves, you can break up two different colors of fabric with a ribbon. So many different things that you can do with the ribbons. We also received a really fat ribbon, and by fat I mean super wide. Um, this is a uh, ribbon printed on a velvet, it's really nice and thick, um, and it's a beautiful print. Look at this, these are quite um, koi fish, as you can see. And this would really be a lovely border on a pillow um, that you are making for your living room or a bag that you're sewing or something like that. It could be lots and lots of different things. So those are our new ribbons that we received in from Renaissance. So check out all our Renaissance ribbons. Just type in Renaissance on our website and they'll all pop up or come in the shop. We have them all neatly placed in one little area. Then we got a new fabric. So the new fabric we brought in was from Paintbrush Studios and this is a super thick flannel. It is the perfect weight to be making robes. Um, you could make pajamas out of it. Um, it is on the heavier side, um, if you see it. So I think it's more of a, a robe type of thing rather than a pajama. Um, it is 100% cotton. It's about 44, 45 inches wide. Um, and it is really well priced, but we are going to price it even better. I believe we got seven colors in and we're going to make them all 15% off now through August 12th. So if you've been looking for a heavy weight flannel, this is not lightweight flannel, this is heavy weight flannel, um, now is the time to purchase it. We have it in stock just in time for sewing for uh, winter or the holidays or whatever. All right, so I do wanna go over as well um, our knit box. For those of you who were registered for our sock boxes or our hat boxes, August was the last month that you have received a box. Those boxes have been discontinued. And now we have one box and it is called the knit box. And with every knit box, you're going to get an amazing yarn. We do try to um, work with uh, getting exclusive colors and things like that, but we always have an amazing yarn in there. We create or we have designed by a designer, a fabulous pattern that is specific for that yarn for you to make the most of that yarn. And then we always toss in some accessories or there's always something else in there as well as a little treat. So when you open your box, if you have the munchies or something, you can have a little treat. Um, and then of course the instructions for the pattern, which is always an exclusive original pattern that we pop in the boxes and we don't sell until all the boxes um, have been delivered and maybe even till the next month. I'm not really sure how that works. Kyle does that part. Anyways, um, our knit boxes, our first one is going to be ship, shipped out and on September, well, the first week of September sometime at that point. And in our knit boxes, you will either, well, let's put it this way. You don't know what you're going to get for a pattern. It could be a sock, it could be a hat, it could be a scarf, it could be a shawl. It could be anything as long as it's something that we feel you could knit in one month or less. And as long as the yarn and the quantity of the yarn fits with in our budget. So I don't think you'll be receiving any big sweaters or anything, but you will be receiving lots of different types of accessories, I would imagine, for the future. Anyways, we only have a limited amount 
of boxes available for our inaugural box, which is going to be shipped beginning in September. So if you're interested in that, we do have a button that you can click in the newsletter that will take you directly to subscriptions. Or if you're watching this on uh, YouTube or something, you can just go to our website, makersmercantile.com, and type in subscriptions and that box will pop up. So if you're interested in it, don't forget to sign up. Um, it's filling up pretty quickly uh, for the first box and um, we just have a limited amount um, left. Now, I also want to give you a little reminder about our clearance room. I know we had a big sale recently, um, but we also have a lot of yarns in there that I think a lot of people really don't know about or, you know, they just look at it and they don't think twice about it. One of those is our yarn called Brighton. This is Brighton. So um, Brighton is a discontinued yarn from Scassell and it was discontinued some time ago. Um, it is a very unique yarn. I want you to look at the structure of that. Um, as you can see, it is roving and that roving um, is sewn together it's actually slightly felted and then there's a little bit of shiny parts in there that are a little bit of acrylic and then on top of that there is a little zigzag stitch pattern that is out of a metallic so it's got a lot going on and i'll be the first to tell you it is not the easiest to knit or crochet with um you can do it it gives you a very thick material so think bags um, and things like that if you're going to be doing that however it is excellent for weaving and it is also really really great for um any kind of crafting things or wrapping gifts, tying a bow on the outside, and at only $350, I mean, it used to be $18 when it was out on the market, at only $350 a ball um, for this kind of construction, I mean, it's a steal. So if you're interested in it, it comes in five colors. Ta da! One, two, three, four, five and you will find all five colors on our website. So I think that is about all I want to cover today. I just want to make sure that you don't forget to register for our um, Tuesday night, our special makers night. Um, we don't normally have it on the second Tuesday of the month. We had one this month already, and it is going to be with the founder and the um, director of June Cashmere, and I think it's just going to be extremely entertaining um, with a lot of really, really great pictures because I, for one, have never been to Kyrgyzstan, and uh, um, I'm really excited to see what it is. That is it for today. It is Friday, so you have a weekend ahead of you. Lots of time to get creative and have some fun, and we will see you again on Tuesday. Ciao.